So this is me basically just trying to get up to speed with FPV. I recently got an FPV um, dictar system and I'm trying it in a simulator. And one of my tasks is basically to try and hover the drone. And as you can see, I am not able to get it working. Like I have been flying drones for some time now and kind of like used to the DJI Mavic, but one thing I didn't realize is how much uh, control the drone is, is trying to help me stabilize my, my drone and try to keep it flying without having to crash it. Um, starting up with this FPV where I have to control 100% everything happening is a lot more difficult than I imagined and I'm still trying to balance my way through it and it, it moves, it, it just doesn't stay stable, it's just moving around left and right. And you can see from the con control sticks movement how I need to be precise as much as possible. Like the DJI Mavics, we take a lot of stabilization for granted and it's easy to forget how smooth it lets you fly without having to worry about. But at the same time, that also cripples you in terms of some of the moves you can possibly do and some of the shots you can get. But um, these are my lessons when it comes to flying and this one my major goal was trying to see if I can hover the drone. Obviously I'm not able to do that um, at the moment and I'm just flying around um, seeing if I can have fun. Uh, it's, it's good to be doing this in a simulator at the moment because I can break the drone without having to um, break my bunk in terms of costing me anything trying to fix the broken part. So I'm currently using the lift off simulator. Um, it's an FPV simulator and I've attached my uh, uh, controller, the DJI FPV controller to my laptop and you know flying it in there. So it's quite challenging and I don't know uh, how long it's gonna take me to master this thing but I'm, I'm trying to spend uh, a few uh, hours every day trying to see if I can fly in this drone and I think this is where I got it close to perfection a little bit and then it just goes off like boom boom you know it's it's trying to um, help counter the movements it's really challenging and, and I find it weird like I don't know if there is a way in the software to kind of like uh, do some of these things for me because I don't know it, it makes no sense like why if if I if I stop moving the joystick like the right joystick I expect it and then the controller comes back to the middle um, the joystick moves back to the middle I expect the drone to come back to the middle like well at least that's what the DJI does um, so anyway, uh, I'm stuck practicing and, and trying to see how to, first of all, hoover my drone for now. And you can see me crashing around still, no, not making any progress in that way. It's, let's go back and start again. So, uh, And for whatever reasons, it gives me drowsiness or it makes me dizzy after flying for uh, some time. I just feel... Um, dizzy and not able to concentrate and, and, and it, it kind of like I don't know maybe after some time I'm gonna get better at it or, or it's gonna go away I don't know but just brute forcing my way through it so far in the simulator um, try to get it working I had to increase the quality from 1080p to um, 2k because I'm able to uh, do that on a 2k monitor and um, yeah, just flying around in, in, in the simulator and trying to see. Oops. Is this a barrel roll? I don't know how to call it, but you're able to do this uh, in an FPV, but almost impossible. I don't know if it's even possible to do that using a DJI uh, Mavic Air or the Mavic Pro or something of that sort. I don't know. Well, so um, that's, that's basically my um, 
um, lesson that I wanted to share with you. I actually fly way longer, but basically the tax for the day was trying to hoover the drone and I failed. I couldn't get it hoovered, like couldn't get it done. So um, that's it me for this video. I uh, will probably be posting some of my lessons and the progress I'm making when it comes to flying an FPV drone. So if you want to follow the journey, you can just uh, uh, sub and we'll see you in a subsequent one. Bye.